Hello, my name is Ilona. I'm from the channel uh, Ware Kracht, which means true power in Dutch. Just made a Dutch version for the Sagittarius and I'm now going to make the English version. So I already pulled the cards and I'm going to uh, explain them to you or how I send things. And uh, these are all energies that uh, uh, are present or are going to be there present in the first two weeks of December 2020 for the Sagittarius. It's always up to you if you're going to do something with it or not and if this resonates with you or not. If it doesn't resonate well then this video is not for you but I hope it does and I hope you enjoy this video. So I'm going to start with the theme of the first two weeks of December so the first to 15th of December for the Sagittarius. It's the world. That's the theme. For the two weeks then I have a general energies and this is for the first week the general energy is the five of cups and I have uh, for the second week of December uh, the two of pentacles Then I have the uh, for the matters of love the love life for the Sagittarius uh, nine of cups that's the first week, the energy of the first week. And then I have for the second week, uh, six of wands. So if I have to uh, review them for the love life, the Sagittarius is in the right spot in the right place, I'd say. So the theme is the world. And the world means something is a cycle is ending. It's the last card of the major arcana cards. So something is ending and you can start like a new beginning a new uh, cycle is starting so see if you can maybe see that energy in in uh, the car in the first two weeks of december so it gives you an opportunity to really end something and really start something new sagittarius well in your general energy uh the first week There'll be some things, some old pains coming up. You have the Five of Cups, so it could be some disappointment or something in your life that is happening. And it's very important to let go of that, to, if you look at the theme, to end that cycle. So in the second week, you will have more balance. You'll be more, uh, it's, it's something lighter, a lighter energy. This is a pretty heavy energy. You can see someone with a black, black cape and just focused on the three cups that are down and he doesn't see the two cups behind him because he's so focused on what's wrong with it and this the second week the two of pentacles you see someone kind of balancing things around it's it's a, it's a, a card of humor a card a card of air it's it's a breath of fresh air so it's very important for you to let go of that pain so you can you know enjoy it more especially Sagittarius it's it's a sign of, of uh, they need a lot of freedom they like traveling they like meeting people and especially in the day this day now it's it's difficult you now there's restrictions because of everything that's going on so see if you can look at it in a lighter way if you can see it from a different perspective so it give you air and as I just mentioned, the love life looks pretty good. <laughs> so as a single, I'm not sure if it means something will come into your life. It means more that you're pretty happy where you are. And if someone comes along, that's fine. If someone doesn't come along, yeah, that's fine too. So it's, it's the nine of cups. It also means the wish card. So you could wish for someone in your life. But it's not like the most important thing you're very happy where you are as a single Sagittarius and the second week will also feel like ah, oh, fine you know it's a very it, it means um, a victory but I don't really see feel like a victory in love but more that you feel good about where you are and maybe for a while time you've struggled a little bit being single but now it doesn't bother you it doesn't face you at all if you're in a relationship as a Sagittarius probably means that you're in a pretty good relationship and maybe it will strengthen the bond maybe you even have a victory in your love life maybe you will um, start moving in or doing you'll grow together more it's more of a card of of uh things moving in the right direction and maybe even a little bit more passion coming in your relationship in the relationship that is 
So it's more of a, the wand stands for fire, for passion, for energy. Even if you're single, it's possible that you'll meet people and, and enjoy in all kinds of ways in the second week. So the second week feels for the Sagittarius uh, well better in a way than the first week but like I said in, in the, the start of the video it always depends on whether you uh, do something with the energy and whether you do something with what comes on your path like this card for instance if pain coming up hurt coming up in that first week do you deal with that or not that is up to you and because you can you have the tools in your hand and if you deal with it you will uh, end a certain cycle and open up things it will give you air and it will give you a feeling of victory so it all depends on how you view things and like i said if it resonates with you or not but that's the most important question and i've also pulled a card from the wisdom of the oracle from colette baron reed and that was here and now and I thought it was quite amusing to see that this person is sitting on an egg or like on top of the egg. And this is kind of an egg shape as well. And the world, you're on top of the world. And in essence, this little girl is on top of the world. So it's, it's very suitable with these, this card. And here and now, it's, it's important to live in the here and now. Just like let the past be in the past. It's very important to bring things in here, to look at things as they are now and to deal with them as, as, as good as you can, as, as well as you can. So balance things more, bring in air, bring in humor, bring in... It's important to for yourself, especially for Sagittarius, to feel that freedom, to feel that like more gentle than very heavy energy. So I hope this resonates with you and I hope to see you in another video. Bye.